Hi lady, it's Asa Crafters. Today I want to show you how I made this courage that I pronounce do I pronounce this right ladies? I don't know. Anyway, can you guys see it? I painted it in black and rubbed it the so the so anyway. So see it's pretty, huh? So this one it look like really messy one, the white one here it look like uh the wheel in the dirt or something really messy there. It's not really like the black one. Can you guys see? You guys can uh see the picture on my Facebook or my blog. See? This one I the door I didn't make like a uh, open the door, I just make like a curtain. Isn't that pretty ladies? So this good project for the big side like 12 by 12 layout to make you know if you have your niece daughters make like a printed layout or you can make for the boy to maybe print charming <laughs> now what I'm going to do is wait, let's start this move this one away um okay we're gonna do this part first this part, uh, I cut the paper, this cardboard at four and a half by six inches. So this, you guys see on the back. So on that corner, I can, I use this cup. This one like, um, what the chip in a container, I'm not really sure anyway. So I use this to try to cut like um, the corner like. So I'm not sure which corner I like one. Maybe this one. I'm trying not to put my head in the camera here. Did I have sound like this? I have only one head. <laughs> so you gotta trim this one up. And now for this, um, I gonna cut this one. Let me um, where are my ruler? I seem to lot everything. Hang on. Okay. Um, for this part, I um, measure at like five eight. Pretty much, I just eyeball it is like this. And then I um I gonna make the door here like this is I measure at two inches and from this one it's two inches so the door is two inches wide there because this the cardboard is um six inches. So we're gonna mark at two and four. Same this one. I hope I'm not out of camera. Two and four. So for the bottom, I can eyeball again, ladies. You know, I'm so lazy to me, just... So what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut this one uh, up, this, the door here. I actually cut this up and I, I hear back to this piece. Because I because I find it easier for me to cut it off first and then I, I hear it back. So I gonna cut this 
up here. Can you guys see it? Then we're gonna cut this part. <coughs> and can I hear this one back? By using the hot glue here. Now for um, this piece on the top there, I cut a piece of this one, 3 8 by 6 and a quarter, so we're going to hear that on the top of there. I think out the glue stick, I'm going to go grab one. And for the tiny piece here, I just eyeball it, got a little bit bigger than that, but I just make a door frame here. I didn't measure it. I just cut like a quarter inch and I will trim this one up. Do the same thing with another side here. And for this piece, I cut the same side these, but um, I didn't cut the, the long because I'm not sure if that gonna fit on this one. I placed two pieces down, so I let her have the long but better than short. So I just gonna measure here. There on a the center. Now for the part of the window, I I cut like um I cover a spiral there and this uh, a a one and a quarter long and five row of this so we can adhere this one a 
if you want to make smaller on your uh, tag or something for small project you the same idea you can make it like a smaller I have been telling you the smaller you the cardboard to the smaller cardboard you make the harder it, it will get because it, you know you're making smaller thing and hard to do it this one perfect size for the 12 12 by 12 layout and now for the curtain I guess you already know so I already show you guys how to do the curtain so I cut the three row here and about um, four and a yeah four and a quarter this one so you need two pieces to make a curtain you turn over here and place this one down So we can I hear this on the top first. Now to mark that to make like uh, this there uh, to make like that make sure this level I'm gonna make like that part so I'm not sure so I just gonna eyeball there so that is the piece of the cardboard I'm gonna use there piece right here this one a little bit too big maybe to adhere this piece all the way to the bottom on this side I'm not gonna glue on this here okay because if you glue that one is maybe you might break the cardboard so we'll over here later when we pull this one here, see, turn around and see that shape, hold this one really tight in, here with the hot glue there. So it's now this one you are ready to adhere to another piece, the bottom there.
see now the next part is gonna be the wheel. 